everybody's top water Johnny. And in this top water frog bass fishing tips video, you're gonna see misses, strikes, and blow ups. Because in this video, I'm gonna be showing you the Jacko Kiera frog. I'm gonna be showing you the Depths Slither K. But the main focus of this video will be on the live target freestyle frog. So let's go. Whoa, there we go. Yeah. Woo, holy cow, folks. Top Water Johnny here, man. This is what we came here for. Look at that. Get back here. Look at that right there. That's the kind of beast that we came here for. There we go. Woo! At that one. Okay, everybody, so here are the three frogs that I mentioned in the opening that I would be fishing with here. As I said before, the Jackal Kiara frog, the Depths Slither K frog, but the main frog, the featured frog for this one is the Live Target Freestyle frog. So I'm not sure how many of you guys have ever seen this one before here, but this frog is actually three inches in length. It actually has, it comes in a package of two, so you get two when you buy them. They run about between $10 to $15 at Tackle Warehouse. Sometimes it fluctuates. And also, what makes this so unique is that the lure itself is injected molding. In other words, it's all clear plastic all the way around it everywhere, but the actual design is inside of the molding here, so you can see that the actual design is inside of this plastic casing that's all the way around it here. And this normally, you would just hook this up with a normal, regular, you know, regular hook here you'd put in here. And then you would just run this across the flats and you would see what happens. So what we're going to do is go right on out to the water right now. And you're going to see this lure in action as well as the other lures in action. So let's go ahead and get started now. Hey, everybody. It's Top Water Johnny. I want to welcome you to the next video here. In this video, it's much warmer here in Florida, so we're going to do our topwater frog fishing. I'm going to be fishing with the Jackal Kiara frog. I'm also going to be fishing with the Slither K by Depths frog right here. And finally, I'm going to be fishing with the Live Target freestyle frog. This one was one of the lures that came out last year, like 2009, that was like voted one of the best uh, lures, soft lures of the year. And I'm gonna be fishing with that one in this video as well. And we're gonna see what happens. So let's go ahead and get started now. All right. All right, our first lure up is that Jackal Kiara Frog. So let's go. There we go. Oh. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Did you see that, everybody, on that frog right there? Man, almost got him. Almost got that one on that frog. So we're going to keep on going. All right. All right. Our next lure up is the live target freestyle frog.
There we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. Woo! There we go, everybody. <laughs> oh. There we go. Look at that, everybody. Boom! We got that one. Nice one there on that runner. Look at that. Look at that. Hooked him tight. All right. Look at that one, everybody. On that toad runner right there. All right. Nice one. Okay. Everybody, stop work, Johnny. Top water is back. And we just came out with a bang. And so I'm really excited about this one because this is really literally my first one of January top water. And you saw it and we were there. So looks like those bass are coming back in and we are back in action. All right. Nice one right there on that toe runner. All right. There we go. Oh. Man, missed that one. Bit it, but didn't fully commit to it. Missed that one, but he didn't fully commit to it, so we're just going to keep on going. All right. There we go. Oh. Ah, gosh. Oh, gosh. There it was, everybody. Did you see that one, everybody? Right there. I just couldn't get him up high enough on the bank to catch him before he jumped back in the water again. Well, I guess we're going to have to count that one as a catch because he did come out of the water. He was on the bank, and we just couldn't get to him in time. So, all right. There we go. There we go. There we go. Woo! There we go. All right. Woo! Look at that, everybody. We got that one. We got that one right there on that freestyle frog. Nice. All right. There he is again on that freestyle frog. All right. All right, everybody. We got another one here on that freestyle frog by live target. So we made one happen here on that one here. So this is number two. So we're working it through that grass and making it happen. All right. Uh, all right, there he is. Not the biggest, but he's fat. All right. All right, our next lure up is the Depths Slither K Toad. Oh. That was a nice hit right there. Wow, that was two nice hits on the depth slither K. Two times they exploded on it, but they're heavy in that grass. And so I think they're just pushing through the grass, but not really getting to the lure itself. So, you know, we're just gonna keep going, see what happens, but those were two nice explosions. All right.
Ah, crap. Crap, another miss. Little bass. There we go. Ah. Crap. Missed that one. Hey, everybody. Talk with Johnny here. Well, you've seen me out here miss two big ones and two little pops here that I've missed on that slither, depth slither K. And um, what I'm learning is that these fish are hiding in the grass. And it might not be the biggest fish. The first two blow ups were pretty big, so I think those are bigger fish. But the rest of them are a little bit smaller, hiding in the grass. So this depth might be too big for them. So I'm going to have to um, reassess the next time I come out this area and come with a little bit smaller, flatter, finesse type lure, top water, that can float on top of the grass, but yet they can get a good hold on it. So that's really what we're going to do uh, as I'm going forward here. But I've got another spot I'm going to go to, and we're going to see if we can make something happen over there. All right. There we go. There we go. There we go. Up, up, up. There we go. There we go. There we go. Out of that gunk. Out of that gunk you go. There we go. There we go. Woo! Nice. On that frog. All right. We got this one good. He is hooked good, everybody. <clears throat> Look at that. Deep in the mouth right there with that top water frog right there. All right. With the rabbit tail. He couldn't resist it. Okay. All right. There he is. Nice one. All right, everybody. It's top water Johnny here. Got this nice one. We in the rain, but we made it happen here. We made it happen here in the rain, top water with that frog. No complaints. All right. Nice one right there on that frog. Okay. Hey, everybody. It's Top Water Journey here. Hey, I hope you enjoyed that video there. Well, that video, it doesn't get more realistic than that. You saw that video that I had quite a few misses out there as well as making some hits happen. And that's really the reality of topwater bass fishing. And a lot of times I don't show you all of those misses because sometimes those misses can be distracting from the actual footage of me catching fish. But I wanted to show you that when I'm out there on the water, it doesn't always happen on that first hit. Sometimes it takes me time to get into a rhythm and really key in on how to nail those fish on top water because I'm always trying to use different and unique lures and when you're using different types of lures that are top water you got to get a feel for how to set the hook when to set the hook so it takes me a little bit of time to get into the rhythm of that now as you saw in the footage I did use this frog right here the Jacko Kiera I had one strike on it but I really wasn't feeling this lure and it was like when I started looking at the actual amount of available hook to stick them with, I got a little concerned. That's why you saw me switch over to the other lures and you saw me using the actual live target, which I'll talk about in a minute. But then you also saw at the end here that I used that depth slither K right here, that depth slither K. And this lure really is a great lure. Like when you squeeze down on that, look at all of that hook that gets into that fish. This right here, Great lure, it's like 19 bucks. Got that little raccoon tail in the back right here. This one really does work great. It's got a kill 
weight on the bottom of it, which makes it really sink into that grass really well. So when it comes out, it really does walk the dog well. So I'm really happy about that one. Happy about the catch I had on it. But the lure in question is this right here, live target freestyle frog right here. Look, when you are fishing in areas where there is heavy cover and the grass is just below the water, and this is the kind of lure to throw right here because it's flat, lays across the top, slides across, but then you've got that hook that can hide in there nice and clean inside of here. Like you're running, you're gonna run it all the way through, it's gonna come out. And then you're able to really have a nice presentation here. As you saw in the video, I'm using my seven foot medium heavy rod with my Corrado, because you heard that noise, that Corrado DC, because I'm throwing it in the heavy cover, 30 pound braid, I gotta get them out of there. So I'm gonna use something that's really a workhorse that can really pull those fish out of that heavy cover because once they bite, they go back into that heavy cover and dig in deep, so you gotta pull them out of there. This lure also bought, you can get two of these, you can get them at Tackle Warehouse. The price actually is $9.99 as of this recording on Tackle Warehouse. And I definitely think it's just a great lure. This right here is the emerald, like emerald red here. I think that's what I called it here. The emerald red. So I wanted the one with the yellow body, bottom on the bottom here, because this is what the bass see. Got a little bit of red on top of here for them to key in on here. Great lure here. So I just wanted to share with everybody those lures. Coming up, I've got a shipment from the Hookup Tackle coming in here. I bought some more top water lures that are gonna blow your mind. And these are really unique and cool looking top water lures. So I'm really excited to fish with them. By Thursday, they should be here. So I'm gonna release the video of them on Thursday and I'll talk about them, I'll show them to you. And then you're really gonna enjoy seeing them because they definitely are unique. And I really do believe they will get bit. So that's what's coming up. I wanna thank you guys once again for being subscribers to the channel. Please like, subscribe to the channel. Always hit the like button because that lets more and more people know about what we're doing over here. That like button is really important because it just helps me grow. It helps more people know what's going on. And once again, I just appreciate so much your support and you guys being a part of that journey. So once again, this is Topwater Johnny saying that phrase. Keep your line tight because when they hit those topwater lures, it's going to be a big bite. I'll see you in the next video.